At Charting Wealth, we have one master indicator for success, and that master indicator is the price percent oscillator. Now, it is on all of our charts, and we look for signal line crossovers where the blue PPO, or price percent oscillator, crosses over the red signal line. When that happens, particularly on our weekly charts, we call it a weekly vertical crossover. And when that occurs, it is a signal that a big wave of either upward price movement or if it happens in the opposite direction, downward price movement is about to occur. And it comes with regularity and we can count on it again and again and again. Now, let's talk about what the price percent oscillator is. It is a momentum oscillator. And what it does is it measures the difference between two moving averages, just like the MACD does. In fact, the PPO is just like the MACD. We're going to talk about that in just one second. And we use the same blue plot line and a red signal line. We see signals that are generated when we have signal line crossovers like we talked about before. When the blue line crosses over the red going up or, the, or it crosses over the red going down. Now, we also note that these signals are no different from those associated with the MACD. So if you're familiar with the MACD, you'll be very comfortable in using the price percent oscillator. What's the difference? Well, the MACD is based on absolute levels. So what happens with that is when you have large price changes, they can affect the MACD over extended periods of time. What that means is that you get inaccuracies that end up occurring using the MACD. You'll see also with high price securities, they'll have higher or lower MACD values than lower price securities, even if the volatility, the volatility is the same, because the MACD is based on the absolute difference between two moving averages, not the percentage. The PPO ends up generating the same signals as the MACD, but it provides the added dimension of a percentage version of the MACD that allows you to compare different securities at different prices and still see the percentage change. That is why we like it. We so appreciate you being with us. Follow our podcast every day at chartingwealth.com. We want you to learn how to follow trends and master these charts. That's what it's all about. Take care from chartingwealth.com.